Well, a friend of the show, Charlie Kirk, has an important new book called The College Scam, How America's Universities Are Bankrupting and Brainwashing Away the Future of America's Youth. Charlie Kirk is the executive director of Turning Point USA. He joins us tonight in the friend zone. Charlie, great to see you. Congrats on the book. The title Thank you. is very strong. I happen to agree with it. But tell us why that's the case. Why is, why is college is currently constituted so bad for young people? Well, well, thank you, Tucker. So most people don't know that 40 percent of people that enroll in four year college will not graduate. They will drop out. So I said, hey, Tucker, let's go get a meal at a restaurant. By the way, you have a 40 percent chance of getting food poisoning. You say, wait a second. How is that restaurant still in business? And then on top of that, if you graduate from college, that means if you get through that first 40 percent, you're part of the 60 percent. Another 40 percent end up getting a job that does not require a college degree. And I'm not even touching on the the wokeism, the indoctrination, the awful ideas. Colleges have become the point of origination of the worst aspects of American society. I've been thinking about this topic for over a decade. In fact, I've lived it. I didn't go to college myself. And it took me about three years to put this book together through some very intense research. There's over 35 pages of footnotes at the end of the book. And one of the reasons I took so much time, Tucker, is that not every conservative agrees with me. In fact, a lot of people on the center right think that it's a rite of passage to send your child to college. I argue in the book that most conservative parents should think twice or three times before sending your kid to a college that does not share your values, will not have the type of financial implications you might think it will, and then also I believe is making the country less free. People can find it at collegescam.com, and all proceeds of the book go to Turning Point USA. Could it be that a lot of maybe people over 50 haven't updated their view of what college really is? They just don't know that it's changed since they went? I think so. But also, Tucker, there is an element that a lot of people in upper middle class suburban society, they are afraid of the social implications of being judged right. by right. neighbors and relatives if their kid does not go to a state school or to an upper east, you know, really good school in the northeast. No one wants to admit to their neighbors that their kid is working construction, becoming a carpenter, a welder or a mechanic. Even if you have strong values and a big family and you're wonderfully married, that doesn't do anything for you in upper middle class society. So I gently talk about that in the book, and I'm trying to make it okay not to have a very expensive piece of paper from a university that does not share your values. I'm trying to destigmatize this idea that kids don't go to college and somehow they're treated in the lower rungs of society. In fact, I believe it's far more important we teach our kids strong values than just getting a piece of paper from a college. That's right. Oh, Dylan's at Cornell, parents say so far. They don't realize Dylan is a Maoist pillhead. Right. Uh, but anyway, Charlie Kirk, thank you for your work thank on you. this. Very important. Congrats on the book.